I'm not worried because I made it bulletproof, just like Keenan says. Jump to the end of this video to see the whole uh, this whole scene in action. Speaking of Keenan, uh, there's an old saying: the more you learn, the more you earn. So if you like watching the laundromat uh, videos in this channel, make sure you check out the other YouTube uh, YouTubers that uh, record in their laundromats. You got Chock Full of Quarters. You got Following Keenan. You got Hot Dog with Dan. You got There I Fixed It. They're all great information on just general um, laundromat stuff. So check out their channels. I'll put their uh, descriptions uh, or their links in the description below. But uh, definitely check out their channels if you're interested in the laundromat content because you can learn a lot. The more you watch, the more you read, the more you listen, uh, the more you're going to do and the better you're going to do in this business. Dum, 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 dum. Enjoy your shortcut, buddy. Soon there'll be a fence. Soon there'll be a fence. Dum, 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 dum. Today we're putting up the fence uh, on the back of the laundromat. We're defending the parking lot that way we'll stop using this to cut through. So we're, we're working on the first post right now. We've got to load, go a little bit lower. But also too, we're going to raise the fence up a little bit because the parking lot does slope down over here. So that's what we're working on today. We use the uh, fast setting concrete mix to dig the holes for the post in, dump this mix in, put water on it. Um, as you can see, we got two of the first posts up. We got chopped on where we want it. We're building that up a little bit, we got a little couple of bricks around it. Because um, we have to fill in uh, the soil here because it gets lower in the parking lot. But we're going to get our fence up right here and right here. Um, Lumber is kind of expensive now, so I don't know how much we're going to do the whole thing, but we're going to get this project started. and. Uh, you know, before winter. Winter's coming soon. Alright, the toys for the claw machine came in. Looks like a ton of different stuff here. We just did the claw machine working and then, uh, we're good to go. If not, I got a lot of stuffed animals for my cats to play with. There, monkey head. Okay, so we found this big rock right there. We had to pry it out. We had to pry it out with this. We had to pull it out. And this thing. See if you can pick it up. Is heavy. You can't pick it up? No. Wait. We might use a gold spray paint and uh, spray paint and gold if we can sell it. Thanks. Oh, my son's always leaving trash over. I gotta clean up after him all the time. Uh, we have a big problem with people pulling up too far into uh, our building, blocking the sidewalk. So we're going to put up metal uh, bollards, which is basically a metal pipe come sticking about four feet. Um, we're going to put them about between the concrete and the sidewalk, um, all along the front of the building. That way people don't park there, and it's safe uh, for everybody. Uh, we got a quote from that uh, fence guy, so we're going to see if we want to get those done. Money. More garbage, more money. Okay, we found this thing on the ground. How much do you want for it? You have to give us 500 bucks. Well, actually, 900. And we Five, don't we don't do delivery either. 5,000. You have to come pick it up. So we got uh, this is the old door right here. Uh, we're moving that around the corner right here. We got the new door installed. Um, 
We're gonna put a deadbolt and stuff on there right now, but right now it's just the handle. Uh, right here, we're gonna frame out for our soap machine and our cha change machine over here, soap machine over here. But we have to move all this, uh, all this junk right here. It's got the AGT sensors. This is our uh, magnetic lock for the front door. And we got the router and modem and other stuff. We gotta move all that just up a little bit and then we can frame in all our stuff. If you look over here, this used to be all open. The furnace is behind that. And uh, we put a door in that we had laying around. And uh, this door back here is gonna have a furnace and all behind our dryers. All behind the dryers is gonna be all open and it's gonna be uh, outside air with movers um, for the makeup air. if you want this big rock. In our secure tool room, we end up getting all the flooring tile out of here in the garbage. We got our tool bench over here. Next big project is to get this big oil tank out of here. It weighs about three, 400 pounds, so it's gonna take a couple guys to get uh, this out of here. We'll call our scrap guy, Jerry. He'll come pick it up, no problem. And then we're gonna have a nice secure room for all our tools.